Gerald Tate's here. He wants to know what's happening to his deal. Go get Harvey. Trust me, I can handle Gerald Tate. I'm sorry, you say the best to me? Harvey, when are you gonna leave Pierce and work for a man? I'll leave Jessica anytime you want. You just have to formally ask. And then after that, why don't you formally ask Santa Claus to bring you a pony? Because I'm not leaving Jessica. I check. Raise 5,000. I'm all in. You can pay me later. I gotta go. Gentlemen. I'm paying you millions. And you're telling me I'm gonna get screwed? Jessica, have I come in a bad time? Gerald, this is Harvey Specter. He's our best closer. Well, if you're the best closer, where the hell you been for the last three hours? Well, Gerald, I specialize in troubled situations. And when I left here at 7 p.m., this deal wasn't in jeopardy. So I'm just trying to figure out what happened in the interim. We keep offering more money, they keep rejecting it. It's last minute bad faith bull. It says here that Cooper won't be staying on as honorary vice president. That's right, I don't want him around. He wouldn't be around. It's an honorary position. I don't give a sh Well, I think you do, because that's what's changed since I left, which means it's you who's been dealing in bad faith. Well, now that you've got a grasp on what's happened in the goddamn interim, what are you gonna do about it? Because he's not getting that title. Well, let me make sure I understand this, okay? We negotiated a deal that gave you everything you wanted. Mr. Cooper signed it. And now you won't close until we take away the last shred of his dignity? Bingo. Well, that's not gonna happen. And why the hell not? Because I like Mr. Cooper, and my firm doesn't operate in bad faith. Oh, I see how it is. Instead of working Cooper, you're working me. Well, why don't you take your pansy attitude back in there and make him sign my deal? Or I'll pay someone else your money to do it for me. First of all, Gerald, if you think anyone's going to touch this deal after your bad faith, you're mistaken. Second, the way our agreement works is the minute Cooper signed the deal which gave you everything you wanted, our fee was due and payable, which is why at 7.30 I received confirmation of a wire transfer from escrow indicating payment in full. So I'd say the ball's in your court, but the truth is your balls are in my fist. Now, I apologize if that image is too pansy for you, but I'm comfortable enough with my manhood to put it out there. Now get your ass in there and close the goddamn deal. You let him talk to me like this? Harvey speaks for the firm. We got paid before Gerald signed the deal. What are you talking about? This is a memo about some fire drill on Tuesday. Huh. You're the blue team captain. You get to wear a fire hat. It's time, Harvey. You ready to go? You go ahead without me. They're packing up the place tomorrow, and I need a little more time before they do. I understand. See you at home. Hey. You know, I couldn't have done any of this without you. Any of what? Everything. I used to rule the world. Seas would rise when I gave the word. Now in the morning I sleep alone. Sweep the streets I Whoa, you 
you give me this, and I will become the best lawyer you have ever seen. You start behind the eight ball, you'll never get in front. Some people love the taste of blood. Better to find out who you are sooner than later. Salieri, Mozart. Are you wearing braces? Let me guess, you're Donna. Oh, you have no idea how Donna I am. Yeah, baby, Butch and Sundance are back. Anyone comes at you with any threat at all, you come to me, you tell me. You tell me everything. I'm a fraud. We're not just colleagues, we're even friends. We're family. To pierce and spectre life. Life is like this. And I like this. That was when I